Hi, guys. Hi. Hello, nice Sandra. You. Nice good meeting evening. you. Good evening. How are you? All good? I'm good. Excellent. All right. Glad to have you here. Uh, nice to meet you, Sandra and Imer Alfredo. How's it going, man? Oh, um, I think Imer is connecting his audio. And then we got Laura. Hello, Laura, Leticia. How are you? Hello. Good night. I'm fine. Thank you for asking. All right. Good to see you here. So we're going to see if uh, somebody else joins, guys. Hi. Good night. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Nice meeting you. Nice to meet you, too. All right, there you go. Um, I am going to ask you guys to turn on your cameras, okay? So um, whenever you're ready, turn them on, because that's one of the class rules. But right now, we're just going to wait for everybody else to come by, okay? Let me pull out the presentation now. There you go, Emer. All right, guys, give me one second. Okay, I don't know if it's gonna be only um, the three of you guys, but uh, we're gonna start now, okay? Because it's kind of a long agenda that we have today. So uh, welcome to Advanced 3. How are you feeling? Pretty good. Feel good? All right. Very good, guys. So uh, let's get down with our introduction today, OK? So the agenda for today, guys, OK? Um, I'm gonna, you're going to get to know me. I'm going to get to know you. We're going to talk about the class rules. And we're going to do a small icebreaker, OK? So first off, my name is David Namas. You can call me David. You can call me David. You can call me Namas, okay? I actually, believe it or not, guys, uh, yes, I am your teacher, but I do not like being called a teacher, all right? <laughs> I mean, it's okay if you call me like that. I'm not going to kick you out from the class or anything, but, but, but uh, yeah, just call me David, okay? All right? So you feel comfortable. Welcome, Ruth. Welcome aboard. Jump into the train. Onto the train, okay? Very good, guys. So um, aside from that, guys, I've been teaching English for more than two years now. I used to teach at e 4 um, I'm part of the TELUS Academy as well. So I work at TELUS. And I work here. Okay, so it's been a long time now. Um, I, I started learning English since I was like four years old. Uh, I grew up playing video games, you know, listening to music in English. So I, I loved English ever since I was a kid. So that's why I grew up, you know, with the language. And I think that's, you know, the, the natural learning method is one of the best ways you can use to learn any language. You know, aside from the grammar and so on and so forth, you know, the natural learning method is one of the best things you can do to in order to learn a language. All right. Welcome aboard, uh, Claudia and Henry. Nice to see you here. All right, guys. So, um, so of course, I studied, guys. You know, at, um, I, I studied back in school. And then uh, I lived in the U.S. for just for a year because I had a scholarship there. Uh, I also speak Portuguese very fluently. I, I lived in, in Brazil as well. Um, so, and I've been throughout all Central America. But anyways, that's, you know, going off topic right now. Um, but yeah, guys, it's been a long time since I've been, um, you know, speaking English, right? Um, I do like, you know, I still like playing video games, although I don't have much time because believe me, I have a tight agenda. So it's really hard to find time, you know, to, to play video games unless, you know, maybe on Saturdays or Sundays. Um, but still, you know, I still have things to do. Then um, <clears throat> I play the guitar. I like to play basketball. I usually go, you know, like I, I, I go, you know, for a walk from once in a while. Um, 
I go to this park, El Cafe Talon, you know, sometimes like at night. Um, so I, I do like walking, you know, or just like going around or jogging, you know. I wouldn't say running because I don't, I don't really run. But if I find people playing basketball in the courts, in the courts, um, I would go ahead, I would go ahead and, and join them. Um, I like traveling. I expect to go to Costa Rica on my next vacation. <clears throat> so whenever I have time available, I'm, I'm gonna head over there. Uh, one of my best friends living there, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and pay him a visit. Um, and uh, I like teaching. I really like teaching. I like having fun. Um, I'm not really that serious. If you think, you know, if you see my face, like if you think that I'm a serious person, I am. I am. I'm. I'm strict. All right, but I'm not serious. Okay, so I like to have fun. Right. Um, what else? I'm. I'm very geeky. I like. You know, I do like reading. I. I mean, to like all the techy stuff. I like to. I like to program, you know, on my free time as well. But again, it's hard to once once you're older, you know, it's hard it's hard to find to find time because um, I'm 30 now. <laughs> All right. Anyways, um, I expect from you guys to have fun, to join the class every day, to ask me any questions if you come across any. And to help each other. We're actually going to go through the class rules, guys. But pretty much, guys, I don't want you to miss any class. You cannot miss any class, right? The One of the main reasons why, guys, is because uh, I don't know if all of you, but you do have a scholarship, right? Or at least, you know, your job is paying you for one. So uh, you cannot miss class, okay? I'm going to be very fine attendance from the attendance that I got today. So I expect to see the same amount of people that I saw today that I see today. Or more people than the ones I, you know, than, than the ones I see today, all right? But um, I do expect you to be dynamic, you know, to participate a lot. If not, guys, don't worry, because I will make you participate a lot, okay? I do make everyone participate. That's, you know, one of the reasons why people, like students usually have fun in that sense, you know? This is an advanced class, and for some reason, you know, whenever we hit, it, we hit advanced, um, people are not that uh, they don't participate as much, you know? Fun fact about me, well, I, I would say that I love eating meat too much, okay? Um, and uh, I'm very picky with, with meat. I don't like eating, um, like usually, you know, when, whenever you go to a, to, a, to a diner, you would find that flat, overcooked meat and I don't like it because I, I, I for some reason you know I like like fancy meat you know like like I like beef I like I, I like uh, um, I, I like a big chunk of meat you know um, so that's a fun fact about me probably I do have more guests but <laughs> nothing else came up you know from the top of, uh, of, of my head um, so anyways <clears throat> so that's about me guys do you have any question for me No, no question. All right, don't worry, guys. If you're shy right now, you will not be shy by the end of the class. Okay. Now, another thing that guys that I want to bring up is that, um, as, I, as I mentioned, I will make you participate. I will make each of you participate. So, I, I do expect you to have the cameras turned on, okay? Because that's one of the class rules. The reason why, guys, is because one day, okay, one day it, it's happened in previous classes, guys. Okay. I've had people naked, okay? Like they have the camera all turned off, all right? And then they're like going, you know, in their underwear. Um, of course, we were not able to see them, but I had, I had this one case and somebody asked me to check on one of the previous videos just because the camera turned on accidentally, you know? So the reason why, guys, is because I want you to pay attention to the class. That's one. And the other thing, guys, the other reason why is because um, where sometimes we play games, you know, I might say, you know, Simon says, touch your head, touch your shoulders. So I was, I would say, I want you to show me something that you can relate to from your, from your house, an item, you know? So I was, I would come up with things like that. And, uh, so I do need you to have the camera on so you can participate. Okay. So if you, if you will, guys, uh, Ruth, Ruth, uh, Claudia and Stephanie Palacios, if you have a camera, um, I don't know if you would mind turning it on, but. 
and that would be great okay anyways guys let me uh get to know each of you okay so let's start with I'm, I'm gonna start from top to bottom guys to whoever um you know from whoever i see first i want you to take you know from three to five minutes to talk about you know your name or how you like to be called okay if your name is i don't know if your name is laura and you like to be called la kimberly right i don't know you might like to be called like that right so uh just tell me your name you know what you do for a living if you don't know what doing for a living is is like what is your job okay what do you do to survive in your life right uh what your hobbies are okay and what you expect from the class and a fun fact about you okay if you don't know a fun fact about you so far guys okay start thinking about about it okay very good so we're gonna start with laura leticia Okay, uh, hi everybody. Um, my name is Laura Ramirez and I like to call, or you can call me Lauri or Laura. Um, what, what do you do for a living? Well, I work as a administrative assistant in Exportadora Rio Grande and I work with people from the United States. That's why I'm here because I want to improve my English and get a, a better vocabulary and listening as well. Um, also, because I have two children and I want to give them a quality of life. And what your hobbies are? Well, I like to play soccer. And I played since 11 years old, I guess. Um, what do you expect from the class? Where? Well, I expect that it will be funny because I worked too much and I want to, I want to, I don't know, um, have something different to, to try to focus in my class and not sleeping. Um, a fun fact about you? I don't know. To be honest, I don't know what to say about Oh, yeah, to come out with a fun fact. I don't know. Maybe you like to eat beans with mayo. <laughs> Have um, you ever done that, guys, eating beans with mayo? You know what that is, mayo? Mayonnaise? No? No. Nope. All right. So I used to be uh, one yeah. of those people, know. you know, like eating beans with mayonnaise. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. No. I don't know something 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 maybe something funny that happened to you I don't know maybe I don't remember right now maybe if I remember I will say it. all right later. sounds good okay think about it because I'm gonna ask nice you to meet you everybody all right very good nice to meet you Laura plus for Laura guys good job Laura all right so then we got Imer or Imer Alfredo I, hey ha, hold on how do you like to be called uh Laura or Leticia Laura all right, Laura, sounds good. All right, uh, Imer, let's go, Imer. Hi, everybody. My name is Imer Palma. I'm 23 years old, and I like to be called Imer. Yeah, just Imer. And what I do for a living, I'm, I am a intern in software development, and I like to program in computers usually nice and one of my favorite hobbies is play video games with my friends right now i don't have any time and i just wait for the weekend and <laughs> the weekend to play and and another hobby is play soccer i i can play ping, ping pong or tennis table whatever you call it and let me add then <laughs> the next question what i don't remember a fun fact can you, right? can you can you see the screen yes i see oh okay i'm, I'm sorry i had the wrong slide <laughs> uh yeah there you go uh, my expectation my respect for the class well i like to learn more english i don't want to get rusty and and also pro i want a better opportunities in the future 
and a fun fact about me. Mm, let me see. I don't remember anyone, but... Uh, I, I've already eaten pupusas with cream. That's not... Weird, but for me, it's a fun fact. Okay, all right, that's cool, man. That's cool. Okay, hey, so you like to program? That's that's very interesting. Have you? What's the best thing that you ever programmed? Probably um, like a support program for an school, an school in San Martin. It was a, like a container, I don't remember. It was a, with a database and something like that. And okay. It was a huge project. All right. Hey, sounds good, man. Nice meeting you. Everybody, you. Nice, nice meeting you, you Emer. Nice to meet you. Everybody, Emer. let's go. Okay, very good. All right. So, hey, Emer, do you like to. Uh, you like to be called Emer or Alfredo? Emer, just Emer. Emer, very good. <laughs> All right, Emer, sounds good. Eric Celada, let's go, Eric. Okay. Uh, good evening, guys. Hello, my name is Eric Celada, and I'm very happy to be with you, sharing these uh, stories, and of course, happy to be with you in order to learn more English. Well, let's say uh, I like to be called Eric like my first name. What I do for a living is I work at the airport. I've been working at the airport for 20 years. And one of the uh, situation that I'm here is because I want to improve all, uh, my English as well, because uh, daily at work, we have a sometimes conversation. So I don't want to be, or I, I, don't, want to be, I, I don't want to get surprised when, so, when somebody tells me something and I, and Probably I don't have an idea how to respond. I've been working there, as I say, for almost 20 years. And what do I expect at, at the end of this course? Well, I expect to uh, speak English better. Better. Uh, well, one of my dreams is talking in English as I talk in, as I speak in Spanish. I hope to be. I hope someday that I can get that that goal. And uh, a fact, a fun fact about me. As a, as a Salvadorian, I can say, I remember that when an, a friend and, and I, we went to the United States, uh, it was in the 90s. And we, they, the, the, the hostess, took us to the apartment hotel and they didn't say how to get out of the, the apartment hotel because we didn't have a car. So the next day that we have some classes, the bus is gonna be picking up us at, 7 30 in the morning so we, we we were almost at the time so what we because we don't know how to get out of the apartment hotel we just jump the fence like a good like a good salvadorian in order to be a on time on the bus stop so that's what a fun fact that i remember oh God, <laughs> and that's yeah <laughs> you, the, the uh, and, you, didn't you care about getting caught what did you not care about getting caught uh, well, not really, because it, it wasn't so high, but like, for example, we talk about that situation with the instructor and he says, hey, you were lucky because if somebody, somebody watched you doing something like that, maybe they call the police and you can get arrested. You would have been a, um, yeah. you would have been a great, a big problem for Trump, you know? Yeah, <laughs> and we know, we, we knew that before. For climbing up those walls, but it was fun. All right, yeah. hey, nice meeting you, Eric. Good job, man. Applause, right, guys. Good job. Too. All right, then we got Stephanie Palacios. Hello, Stephanie. Hello, hello, everybody. Nice to meet you. Uh, well, my name is Stephanie Palacios. My six, well, uh, I like to be called Lupita. Everybody calls me like that because my name is Stephanie Guadalupe. And uh, just let me double check there. 
the introduction here. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, what do I do for a living? Well, actually, I worked for a call center. Um, I worked in Concentrix. And oh, really? well, what here I am. What account do you uh, work in? AT, yeah, AT&T. Oh my God, I used to work. I used to work for that account. Oh, uh, really? Too. Yes, it, it's, a long time ago. It's really, it's kind of difficult for me because I'm starting. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> It'll but, be difficult, uh, yes. <laughs> yes, but I hope uh, doing well. And um, that's why I'm here uh, because I really want to improve my English and not just my English. Um, I really want to improve my listening because I think that that's the, the hard part for me. And my one of my hobbies, um, one of my favorite hobbies is the photography. I love taking pictures of, like, I, I don't know, such as nature, landscapes and so on. And uh, what do I expect from the class? Well, as I told you before, um, I do really love, I do really um, want to improve my listening, uh, my vocabulary also. And um, what else? A fun fact about me. I think that a fun fact will be that I am almost a physiotherapist. But nowadays I'm working as an agent, as an AT&T agent. So I don't know. <laughs> you mean, um, you know, um, money. <laughs> but right. uh, it's cool. It's cool to to uh, learn new things and and I don't know uh, have the challenges in your life. So hopefully I will do. Uh, I will. I will do my best uh, being there, being working there. And well, that's it. All right, very good. Applause for Stephanie and nice to meet you, Stephanie. I'm glad that you're Thank you, you here. Too. Okay, pretty good. Thank All right, you. then we got Morena Melara. Hello, everybody. Hello, Morena. Um, um, well, um, my name is Morena Melara. I'm working in Mulbauer ID Services uh, El Salvador. It's from Make uh, Duis. I don't know if you know what is that. It's about what, uh, I'm sorry? About uh, Make Duis. Oh, I didn't your, know that. Your ID, ident your ID in identif identification. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. And Actually, um, in my job, I am, uh, I am uh, in a in a different uh, department, and and I need to practice a lot of my a lot my 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 English. I need to improve uh, my English uh, because I actually I have um, an opportunity in this moment and. I try to learn a lot because I have to do different tasks and their content. Uh, and I need to know um, more about the new language because it's a an, an German company. It's a German and, company. Yes, in, in, in this case, um, the department and I am that I am working is a service, but I am in the in the administrative part. Um, about my hobbies, I like a lot of things. Actually, I love listen mus listen to music, and watch different movies, um, fun movies actually, and. The other, I like to dance. I like, I like cooking, but dessert. Okay. Uh, about my aspect from the class. Um, I just talk about the improve my English because I, I think it's really important. 
because uh, we need um, practice and know um, different vocabulary, new vocabulary, and the structure too. It's really important to make it. And about fun fact about you, actually, um, I think for me the the fact the fun fact are uh, the classical music and read interesting book and only that I think. All right, very good, very good. Okay, super good. Nice meeting you, Marina. Good job, plus for Marina, guys. Well done, Marina. All right, so we got Stephanie, Claudia, Sandra, and Ruth. Okay, so Stephanie. Oh, no, no, Stephanie, you ready? Did you ready to introduce yourself? Yeah, you did. Okay, then we got... Uh, uh, yeah, I, uh, I already yes. took. Yes, uh, for some reason you went down the list. All right, anyways, uh, so Claudia Tovar. Let's go, Claudia. Okay. Uh, hello, everyone. Nice to meet you. My name That's is me. Claudia Tuba. Uh, uh, you can call me Claudia. And I live in San Salvador and I'm from Zacatecoluca. Nice. Uh, I, am, I am an accountant and I work as independent auditor. Uh, my entertainment is swimming and running with my two daughter and my husband on the weekend. Uh, I like to visit the countryside on weekend. And my expectation in this course is um, learning more English and especially listening, uh, listening the area of the listening. Uh, a fun fact about me is I like to cook uh, typical dishes, I like pupusas, I like to cook cakes, and uh, really I like to cook all the dishes. All right, so you like cooking. Uh, nice to meet you, teacher. Nice to all meet right. you. That's great, okay. I am not really into cooking, but I wish I could learn, all right? Nice meeting you, Claudia. Plus for Claudia, guys. Good job, Claudia. All right, then moving on, we got Sandra. Let's go, Sandra. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sandra Basurto, and I want you to call me Sandra or Sandri because, I don't know, that made me feel like something sweet like a pastry and uh, um, like a pastry. what do I do for a living okay. at this moment uh, <laughs> yeah just my name <laughs> all right sounds well, good don't worry well I I don't work at this moment because I have a lot of means to do a hospital not a as a part of the workforce but as a patient so and also I will start the the university this year. So I was planning to, to start working on December, but all my plans just changed from all of a sudden. And well, after that, my hobbies, <clears throat> I'm sorry, my hobbies are doing embroidery. Do you know what is embroidery? Nope, I'm not really sure I know about that. Hello. Can you hear me? Okay, embroidery yeah. is like painting, but yes, I can. Okay. Okay, embroidery, embroidery, I mean, like painting with thread, a piece of cloth, something that you draw on the piece of cloth and you paint it with needle and different colors thread. And that's what I love to do. Besides that, I love painting and also reading books, but I'm not a geek. Well, my expectations from this class is a lot. I think that sometimes I get a little bit frustrated because 
there are some topics that are really difficult to understand, but um, uh, I know that it is it will be easy if I if I inspire myself or I continue just improving. I would like to improve all the basic areas like listening, comprehension, or speaking. And finally, a fun fact about me, I like to make weird noises from animals or some noises that I heard on TV just to make a really funny moment with my family and all of them start just laughing just because of that. Oh my God, I've never heard something like that. And I'm glad to meet you guys. All right, nice meeting you too, Sandra. All right, one of these days you might actually surprise us with. I'm a kind of, with one of those, parrot. One of those, um, <laughs> that's called an onomatopoeia, right? So, very good. Okay, nice meeting you. Applause for Sandra, guys. Very good job. Well done. Okay. Yeah. And then finally, we have, oh, we have somebody else. We have Henry Cibrian. And we have Ruth Ramirez. Hello, Ruth. Good evening, guys. Good evening. Oh, I think I think you uh, have some um, issues. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you now. Go ahead. Okay. Um, yes. Uh, well, my name is Ru. Um. I am 33 years old. Um, I would like to be called just Ruth. And well, about my job, I work at Lika. That is a company who sports some cookies of rice and flavor. Uh -huh. Can you hear? Yeah, I can hear you. Yes. Oh. Okay, and I have many to prepare all the material to make cookies of flavors and and please. And then what? I'm sorry. Okay, I think I think you cut off. Okay, so I'm gonna interrupt you right now. I'm sorry. Um, all right. Oh. I think I think you have issues with your connection right now. Now, okay. now let me ask you. Let me ask you something, guys. Can everybody hear me just fine right now? Yes. No. Yes. Okay. Right. Yes. Just, just making sure the connection is. Yes. Good. yes. Very good, guys. Okay. Well, um, nice meeting you. Thank you very much. Ruth, okay, so applause for Ruth, guys. Very good. Awesome. I think that's everyone, right? That's all eight of you. All right, guys. So, uh, real quick, guys, let's talk about the class rules, okay? All right, this is very, very important, all right? Like, extremely, extremely important, guys, okay? So, I understand, and let me ask you, if, and, and tell me if I'm wrong, okay? However, before we continue, guys, I want you to do me a favor. You see, uh, you should all be on the WhatsApp group, guys. Okay. So do me a favor. Send me, send me a message, guys, on WhatsApp with your name. Okay. Just, just your name. Okay. Because I want to see what's your phone number. In case you, you like, you, you, in case you have an issue, guys. Okay. Um, I need to know, you know, what, how to contact you. All right. So just send me a message right now, guys, uh, with your with your name, all right? So I can have it here. Very good. Thank you, Emer. All right. So Emer just sending me as a message there. All right, guys. So uh, moving on, okay? So while you do that, let's talk about the class rules, okay? All right. So we're gonna talk, guys, about uh, being present every day and being on time, participation, turning on the cameras, having a notebook. Helping your classmates, completing the platform, technical support, you know, and we're going to have a nice breaker at the end, okay? Anyways, guys, 
So uh, being present every day and being on time. Who would like to help me read, guys? Me, David. Who would like to help me read? No? Nope. Okay, all right. So to choose someone, guys, I'm going to do a small activity right now, okay? So I'm going to pick. I want to. Oh, okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Help me read. Go for it. So, okay, so let's see, guys. So, Ruth Ramirez, no, actually, no, not, not Ruth. Okay, Sandra, help me read. Okay. Be present every day and be on time. No expectations are allowed. Exceptions. You will not be able. No exceptions? Uh huh. Okay, no exceptions are allowed. You will not be able to continue studying in further programs if you miss a class. Not being able to apply for another scholarship. Expectations require documentation. Exceptions require documentation. Coming late might be considered as missing a class. Very good, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna thank you very much, Sandra. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna take over right now, guys, due to the time. Okay. But I do want to mention, guys, that you cannot miss a class. Okay. All right. The reason why, guys, is because I think everybody here has a scholarship, right? Yes? Who doesn't yeah. have a scholarship, guys? Who does not have a scholarship here? All right. So if you if you miss a class, guys, I understand. Please let me know beforehand, and you need to bring the documentation, OK? All right? If you're working and things like that, OK? I, if you're working, guys, I mean, you can still join, OK? I don't mind if you're working and then you join the class, if you have something else to do, OK? But you do need to. Uh, to be present in the class, okay? Also, guys, if you're going to come late, just let me know. But please come, all right? It's more important. I, I do care about you coming early, guys. But it is more important, you know, that you're present during the class, okay? I do send the tenants every day, guys, so InstaForb can see. So that's really, really important, okay? So we are eight people here. I, I expect to see eight people from here until the end of the class, right? Okay. All right. Uh, do we have any questions here? No, we're good. All right, then. Second rule, guys, participation. All right. Now, if you don't participate, guys, I'm going to I'm gonna squeeze you, okay? I'm going to make you participate a lot, okay? I do play games, guys, to make you participate. Sometimes we say, like, Simon says, okay, the last one to stand up, things like that, okay? So I do, and we're going we're gonna to see an example of that in a moment, guys, okay? But I do need you to be proactive, okay? Like me, me, David, okay? If you participate, I'm not going to make you participate as much, okay? So I'm going to pick on the people who are kind of shy because in order for you to improve your English, you know, the best way, well, actually, the best way to do it is actually to, to start talking, okay? All right? Yes? And also, guys, I always QA check yeah. on you to make sure that you understood, okay? Turning on the cameras, guys, absolutely 100% important. Why is it important, Claudia Tovar, why is it important to have the camera turned on? Can you help me read? Uh -huh. Claudia, would you, would you please help me read? Yes, having the camera turned on is required to make sure everyone is paying attention, participate, and is able to play games in the class. Very good, guys. Okay, that's reason, that's the reason why. Okay, because I know, guys, that we like to go to the bathroom, right? You're like in the bathroom with your cell phone like this. You know, get in, you're taking the class like that now, guys, okay? Or you're, like, laying in your on, on your bed, guys. And I've seen, you know, I've seen cases like that. You know, people laying and they're taking the class right like that, right? So I don't want you to do that. I want you to, you know, be a, um, to pay attention, just participate. Have fun, okay? Very good. Have a notebook and a pen. Everybody show me your notebook and, the pen and your pens. <laughs> There's something called 
Very good. And Thank you, Ruth. Okay. I have a question. If if my notebook is worth. If your notebook if is what? Worth. Office worth. <laughs> oh, okay. Right. You you mean like you, you're using your computer? Listen, I do. The thing is that um, I do want you to take notes. It's okay if you use your computer. It's absolutely fine. But I will ask you. I will always be checking on you. Okay. So. If you're if you're gonna do it like that, that, that's okay. That's absolutely fine. But I'm gonna ask you, like I make sure, guys, that everybody understands. Okay, I make everyone participate. All right, and I'm like, okay, what? Uh, okay, so so uh, if I teach you about present perfect, okay, I will ask uh, Morena. All right, Morena, what what's the definition of present perfect? If I just explain, okay, because I do want you to be taking notes all the time. Got it? Yes. Okay. So very good. I will ask you about. You know what we've gone through so far guys okay now helping your classmates guys okay now helping your classmates listen um i will i will always work with you guys if you have if you come across any questions you know i will try to answer those questions whenever i have the time available i do work i work like 12 13 hours guys and i also study so i'm like really 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 busy okay however the classes are uploaded to YouTube every day. Where are they uploaded? Where do we upload it, guys? YouTube. YouTube. Everybody, where do we where do we upload them? To YouTube, right? On YouTube channel. Very good. All right. So your classes, this class is going to be uploaded there today. Okay. You can watch it tomorrow or you can watch it in two hours. Okay. But it will be uploaded. Okay. So now if you have a question, you can ask me, or you can ask, just ask on the WhatsApp group, okay? Sometimes you know somebody else has the, the answer and you can help each other, okay? Of course, I, I will help you guys whenever I can. However, if you miss a class, guys, I will not answer a question for you, okay? Pay, pay attention to that. If you miss a class, I'm gonna ask you to watch the class on YouTube. Got it? And you cannot miss a class. You have to send me documentation, right? So don't think, don't think about it. All right. Completing the platform, guys. Okay, I have something to show you here, okay? So, uh, Laura, do me a favor and help me read. Okay, complete the, the platform. The most important thing for this course is to have the platform complete at 100%. You need to finish the platform before the last week. You can rewatch a class from or YouTube channel. All classes are uploaded every day. If you have doubts regarding a specific class, please ask, ask for help on the WhatsApp group and watch the class on YouTube. You need to attend the class even if the platform has been complete before, before, before hand. Before Very good, hand. applause for Laura guys. Good job, Laura. I bet to you. All right, anyways. So let me show you something real quick guys, okay? First of all, guys, let's make sure that we all have access to the platform. Who does not have access to the platform, guys? Do we all have ac access to the platform? Yes? Yes. Very good. Yes. All right. Yes. By the end, okay, very good, guys. So we only have four sections in this course, okay? Now, I will ask you to send me, I want you, all right, so I will ask you to come here, guys, okay? You're going to come to progress. Where are you going to go? Progress. You're going to click progress. on progress, okay? You're going to click on progress. You're going to pull it up, okay? So once you pull it up, you're going to come up with this. These guys right here, by the end of each week, has to say 100%, okay? The only thing that the platform scores is basically the, the exercises, okay? So you can finish the whole platform today if you, if you want, okay? I wouldn't recommend you doing that. I mean, you can do it, but if you want to understand, just you might want to go along with me, okay? But by the end of each, by the end of this week, guys, by let's say by Friday, you have to send me a screenshot with this, and this has to say 100%. Is that, is that clear? Yes? Who has a question here? Oh, nobody? Yes, it is. All right, very good. 
Okay. So same for section two, guys, by the end of the second week, third, and so on and so forth. Okay. All right. All right. Now, this is the most important thing, guys, overall. Okay. All right. Now, technical support. Okay. We do have some things, guys. You're, you're going to run into issues. Maybe you have issues with uh, logging into the platform or logging to zoom okay if you run if you come across issues like that i would please recommend you ask you to contact the technical support team on whatsapp all right just send them an email uh you should have gotten an email with information on who to contact okay if you really don't know guys you can ask me and i will try to help you after the class okay during the class guys i can't help you log in because i need to deliver the class okay Got it? So I do need I need I do need to deliver the class so I cannot dedicate my time, you know, um, to um, to helping you with with uh, you know logging into the platform for that matter. Okay. All right, guys, and having fun. Okay. That's it. All right. No. Uh, we're gonna do we're gonna do um, a nice breaker. Don't worry, guys. Today is just blah 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 blah. You know, class rules. Blah blah blah. Right. Don't worry, guys. I do like to, you know, to keep the class entertained, okay? So we're going to do a nice, a nice breaker, okay? I want you guys, I want everybody to look for an item, okay? It could be whatever, guys. Whatever you think represents you, okay? Coca-Cola or, or a cell phone, whatever. Look for an item in your house that represents you, okay? And you're going to bring it to me. I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you two minutes, okay? I'm going to give you two minutes to look for an item, you're going to bring it over, and you're going to tell me why that item represents you. Got it? Got it. Very good, guys. Okay, so you got two minutes. Go ahead and look for the item. All right? And you're going to tell me, hey, you know what? These uh, Pepsi Light represents me because I'm fat. And I want to do this. I don't know, guys. These, um, these, uh, these, these Pepsi Light represents me because I am very sweet. You know, and the... <laughs> I like to be sweet with people. I don't know, guys. Whatever. Use your imagination, okay? All right, guys. So um, you got one more minute. All right. Very good. Henry. Hello, Henry. I'm not sure if he's part of the class or from in support. All right, guys. We got 30 seconds. All right, let's start then, okay? So uh, let's start with, okay, so let's do something, guys, okay? We're going to play Simon Says, okay? Whoever makes a mistake, okay, is going to be my participant, okay? All right, are you ready? So the, the game goes like this, okay? I say... Simon says, touch your head. Simon says, touch your shoulders. Simon says, touch your eyebrows. Simon says, touch your nose. Simon says, touch your mouth. Simon says, touch your, all right? So if I say touch, you have, what well, you have to do, guys, okay? You have to touch whatever I mentioned. If I say, touch your neck, and I do this, and you do this, guys, then you make the mistake, okay? And you're my, part, my, my participant. Got it? Very good, guys. Real quick, okay? All right, so... Yeah. All right, so Simon says, touch your head. Simon says, quickly, guys, quickly, Claudia. All right, Simon says, touch your no. Simon says, touch your neck. Simon says, touch your shoulder. Simon says, touch your eyes. Simon says, touch, ah! <laughs> no, I said, touch your eyes, Eric. Okay, too slow, all right? <laughs> Eric. All right, so what item represents you, Eric? Well. In my case, I'm going to talk about this watch. All right. Yeah, just do my favorite, guys, because it's uh, 8.51. Just make it 30 seconds, 30 to 45 seconds, right? All right. Very good, Eric. Go. All right. Go well, uh, let's say that this watch represents me because uh, I need it because I have I need to be in time in my work. And also, I have to take time when I go to the country or when I go to the, uh, uh, let's say, the park. When I do some jogging or running, I need, for example, today at night, I went to the stadium, to the track, and I walked for 30 minutes and I ran for uh, 15 minutes. Then I came back here 
in order to be in class. That's what I was two or three minutes late in the class, but I was taking my time in order to be on time. So that that's this way to present me because I like to be on time in places and I hope to be in complete this course on time also. Very good. A plus for every guys. Good job, Eric. Good, good, good job. Okay. All right, guys. My next participant is going to be the person, the first person to show me the result with your hands. Okay. So you're going to use your hands to show me the result. Okay. All right. Show me the result of, of uh, let's see, 1 million. Minus nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. Okay, so what is the result with your hands of one million minus nine <laughs> nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine? Very good, Sandra. Good job, Sandra. Pick someone. <laughs> Pick someone, Sandra. You won. Pick someone. Choose someone. You you're muted. Laura. Laura, let's go, Laura. So tell us what item represents you. Okay, I I identify with this cactus because I consider that it's a resilience plant because it survived without water for a long time, and I consider a warrior because I'm really strong and um, I can survive and I and I can flourish in any place when God put, put me. And also because uh, it's, beautiful, it's a beautiful plant and really strong and looks like, like a dangerous plant, but it's not, it just is, it is, it is his appearance. That's it's his appearance, okay. All right, good yes. job, plus for Laura, guys. Nice representation. Okay, good job. All right. Simon says, touch your nose. Simon says, touch your lips. Simon says, touch your eyebrows. Simon says, touch your shoulders. <laughs> no, sorry, not the shoulders. All right, very good. Okay, so uh, Ruth Ramirez, pick someone, Ruth. You want, so pick someone. Uh, I choose this book. Okay. Um, amazing. Okay. Because I consider that I have many stories to share with others, like this book. Interesting stories. Oh, and nice. Uh -huh. Funny stories as well. Yes. Yeah. That, that's actually very smart. Very good. Applause for Ruth, guys. Very good. Okay. Good job, guys. Very good. All right. Thank you. All right, guys. So let's see. What's your favorite color, Ruth? Um, my favorite color is black. Black. Okay. All right. Morena, you have black eyes. All right. Let's go. <laughs> no, that are brown. <laughs> It, mm -hmm. that's that's black for me okay i don't see i only see <laughs> black and white guys so everything is black or white <laughs> i'm daltonic okay i'm just kidding guys all right very good uh marina let's go okay um this cap represent me because i i think always actually i need for to drink um a lot of coffee or tea depend on my of my my day if it's a stress i really need a tea and if i am really um uh, maybe i if i am really like take it easy or or not busy day, or if i not, i don't have any busy day I just need to uh, take a, or drink a cup of coffee. Drinking a cup of coffee relaxes you. All yeah. right. Very good. All right. Applause for Morena, guys. Well done, Morena. Okay. Due to time, you guys, I'm going to, due to the time, I'm going to pick someone else. Okay. Real quick. Alfredo, tell us what represents you in 30 or 45 seconds. Okay. Hey, uh, I guess it's, it's me, right? Yes. 
Okay. That's I don't get friend. used to when you when someone called me Alfredo. Oh, okay, email, email. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, right. this this cell phone represents me because I Oh, like dude, to... I was going to choose the same. <laughs> <laughs> because I like to be communicated with my friends and with my okay. family and there is a great I can listen to my, my music, I can watch videos, and basically this is a little worth of me. <laughs> okay, all right. Sounds good, a plus for Emer, guys. Good job, okay. All right, you. He should, you should have said that you chose that cell phone because you have a silver tongue. You know what a silver tongue is? Silver, no. silver tongue, pajero, all right? <laughs> all right, very good. <laughs> All right, then we got <laughs> Stephanie. Let's go, Stephanie. Okay, well, um, in my case, I have chosen my headphones because I do love listening to music and, uh, well, the headphones really, I think that really represents me because everywhere everywhere uh, I go, I every time I, I used to have my headphones on, so that's why I chose my headphones. Okay, all right, that's 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 clever. Okay, good job. That's for Stephanie, guys. Good job, Stephanie. All right, I think I'm missing uh, Claudia, right? <laughs> oh, you're you're muted. You're muted. I thought that was the Bible. All right, uh, Claudia, you you <laughs> you're muted, Claudia. Está muteada, all right? There you go. <laughs> yes. I don't need to. In my case, this boot represents me because the, uh, this boot is my life, really, really. Uh, I feel identified with this boot because I have worked all my life in auditing, in accounting, in accounting, in, okay. in many companies, in many companies, industrial, commercial, service, financial. I have actually lied my career as an auditor because it has been very good and profitable uh, with many tasks, really, and sleepless nights, but really great. Uh, he told me the financial term and that I have applied in my, in my life. All right. Only Sounds that. Good. Sounds good. Applause for Claudia, guys. Well done, Claudia. All right, am I missing anybody, guys? No? Are we all good? All right, I'm, I'm Sandra. just gonna... Sandra. Yeah. Sandra, we're missing Sandra? Oh, okay, Sandra, let's go. Sandra. Okay, well, now it's nine o'clock. Well, I pick this one. It's a package of biscuits. It, and I think that this represents me because it's a perfect balance between sweetness and bitterness because it's made of chocolate and and it represents me because I can make a lot of friends, but uh, the bitter, the yes, the bitter part makes me choose and select the best person or the best people in my life because sometimes you know that you can count on all people around you. Some some of them are going to betray you. So I that's why I consider myself like a piece pastry. All right, that's good. Okay, very good. Applause for Sandra, guys. Very good. This cell phone represents me because it's time to go. Okay. <laughs> no, guys. Um, I, I didn't have. We don't have much more. Uh, more time anymore. But, um, guys, it's been a pleasure meeting you. Please hit me up on WhatsApp if you uh, come across any questions, guys. We'll have a class tomorrow, guys. The class will be a regular class tomorrow, so I do expect you to be on time. I, I really liked each of you guys, okay? Uh, you guys are great. Let me recommend you something, guys, okay? I know that you're, 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 you know, your job is to complete the platform. However, guys, if you do want to learn how to speak, please go uh, try to use this website, guys, okay? Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send this as a message, guys. Okay, this is a YouTube channel, okay? And look for... And look, look for these things, okay? The reason why, guys, is because I, I want you to improve that pronunciation, okay? We have, we don't have five vowel sounds in, in Spanish, in, in English, okay? 
just like in Spanish, okay? When you say, when you say, uh, for example, these, these is not this, it's this, okay? There are like short vowel sounds and long vowel sounds, okay? And a lot of other things, guys, okay? So, but if you want to improve, guys, okay, just I recommend you doing that, guys, okay? All right, that's because I'm going to be correcting you as we go along, okay? Uh, other than that, guys, uh, do you have any questions? No, no questions? Nope. All right, the class will be uploaded today, guys. If you want to rewatch it again for some reason, if you want to rewatch the introduction again, I'll see you tomorrow early, guys. Nice meeting you. Have a good day. Well, have a great night. Let's get okay. you. Take care. Good night, guys. Nice to meet you. See you around. I just want, I, oh yeah. I'm sorry. I just wanted. Bye -bye. I'm sorry. I just wanted Bye. to say that I am. I am not enrolled in the WhatsApp group yet. Oh yeah, you sent me a message, right? Yeah. Uh, I will. I can't. You know what? I for some reason I can't add you, but I will. I will report you, okay? Okay, thanks. All right, thank you, Stephanie. You have a great day. Okay, thank well, great you night. too. Bye-bye. <laughs> great night, guys. Okay. Thank you, Karen. See you guys. You. See you around. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.